Yo, what is good, Rice Ball Gang? Today, we do have some more Bleach. And last time, we saw Ichigo's complete full bring. And Tsukishima basically manipulated everybody that is close to Ichigo's memories, except for, like, Ginjo and I assume Urahara and Ishin and all them. So before we do get into it, if you guys are new to the channel and you do enjoy, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Become a part of the Rice Ball Gang today. Also, I forgot to introduce the bald man himself, aka Boda DSK. <laughs> What's up, guys? Things are about to get crazy. I'm excited to see what happens. Boda, you just lagged out and it was frozen on your face. <laughs> but anyway, let's just get right into it. Oh, oh, Urahara? And Ishin. Yo, what is... A sword made out of spiritual pressure. Are they trying to help Ichigo get his powers back? Dude, the entire end of last episode, Tsukishima is literally f***ing with Ichigo. Because he's literally using the people closest to him. Damn! They had hella safe houses! Nah. Well, to be fair though, after his sister got hurt, he was in search of power and he, he just complied with Ginjo. Like, he didn't have to exactly go to him. Dude, but Ichigo's just frustrated right now. And it seems like Ginjo doesn't know that Tsukishima possesses power. It's to disrupt memories. A manipulation of the past. Yeah, that would, that would make sense because in the flashback with like Ichigo and Chad under the bridge, Chad remembered it Instead of it being Ichigo, it was Tsukishima. Bro, that is crazy. Bro, that is mind-fucking. And my thing is, so if, if they were able to defeat Tsukishima or kill him, would their memories be able to return? I, I would think so. Oh, literally, she was asking the question. <laughs> mm, that's crazy, bro. Damn, dude. We actually might get to see this dude die, bro. <laughs> Is Ichigo going to be able to catch a body, bro? <laughs> Is that Yukio? So they found him. How the fuck did they locate him? So it seems like Yukio's just there. Oh, did he put a tracker? Bruh. Let's go back. We felt so but bro, you're just being used, man. Fuck, dude. I can't blame Yukio, though, because he obviously doesn't know, but... Yeah, because if their only option is to fight, I guess that's the smartest thing for them to do. And Ishida, Ishida's memories aren't, you know, manipulated, so so he's good too. Which is odd, because he is someone close to, to Ichigo. I don't know if it's because he's a Quincy or not. Bro, but the thing is, is if everybody is in his house, they're not going to be... I don't think Ichigo and Ginjo are going to want to fight because they're going to have to get through the people they care about. They don't want to hurt them. I will say, though, Tsukishima got a nice-ass mansion, though. That's facts. That's facts. Ichigo has to play this one a little more, like, smart. So maybe Tsukishima will actually reveal what his plan is. Huh? What the hell? Dude, and Tsukishima is definitely going to use the people around them to like 
try and get his way or what he wants. Dude, that's slowly just eating at him, bro. Oh, dude, that is pissing him off slowly and slowly, bro. I don't blame him, though. I'd be pissed the fuck off, too. Dude, Ichigo, no, bro. Don't rush in. Dude, this is probably what Tsukishima wants. I feel like he's definitely trying to lead Ichigo. I want to kill him, so Ichigo's going! Ichigo's going for the kill, bro! Dude, this is like... I think this is like the first time we've also like... Heard each those words come out of Ichigo's mouth. I want to kill someone. That is crazy, bro. But I guess it's... When it comes to the people you care about... It'll... I don't know. It'll do some things to you, bro. <laughs> Oh no, but oh, oh shit. And we know they're not afraid to attack because they attack Ginjo. Dude, look, now Ichigo's fucking cornered. Yep, he led him to that fucking trap, bro. Oh, is that, that, that's gotta be Ginjo. Okay, I mean, they're gonna fight, but what if they break the fucking house, bro? And everybody's just in there downstairs, bro. Oh, dude, Ichigo, Ichigo really do want to kill this man. Dude, that form is fucking sick, bro. Dude, look at his eyes, bro. He really wants to fucking kill him, dude. I kind of like this side of Ichigo, Loki. Oh. Okay. I guess if Ginjo has to, he will fight them. Oh, he can do... <laughs> oh, dude, he can launch him off the pool. Okay, he's got, he, he got some good hits in. Oh. Oh, my God. Ichigo, Ichigo's full ring's kind of fucking broken, dude. Well, against all their full bringers, but... In the manga... When he slashed his arm, his like arm actually like got cut off. Bro, are you serious, bro? Why did they put that shit in? Well, that's fucking Ichigo for you. <laughs> Dude. Oh, Chad. Oh my God, bro. And if Chad's there, that means Orihime is there too. Fuck, bro. Dude, they're not even saying anything to Ichigo, bro. Damn, bro, you get... Damn, bro, Ichigo's like, damn. He stole my girl. <laughs> that actually pisses me off. I would have been okay if Aizen boomed her. But Tsukishima, man! Fuck this guy. Ichigo, fuck him up. He really done stole his girl, bro. He went Mr. Steal your girl. Because you're different. Yeah, he's just... Oh my god, dude. Bro, what the fuck? Dude, I feel like Ichigo right now, bro. This shit's pissing me off how hey, this motherfucker's just in their memories like he's been there the whole time. Hell no. I better not see this motherfucker in the damn Okiora fight if they show that flashback. I'm gonna be pissed if I see him. No! Fuck that, bro. Fuck that. No. Get that bullshit out of here, bro. Get that bullshit out of here. That's disrespectful. And it's a Heisen fight! I got, bro. We better see Ichigo murk this motherfucker, bro. This shit is disrespectful. Oh my god, dude. Oh shit. Dude, he's fucking fast. <laughs> that was a pretty good fucking episode, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Holy shit. Dude, so literally... Dude, that power is actually kind of fucking broken. Because like... 
Tsukishima, if he wanted to, he could literally manipulate. He he has an army essentially. He has an army, and it's and it puts Ichigo in this weird position because Tsukishima is basically using those people that Ichigo cares about as his protection because he knows Ichigo is not going to want to put any of those people in danger or like let alone like actually attack them if you think about it in a way and I know people hate comparisons but in a way it's like the when when uh Obito did the reanimation jutsu in the fourth grade ninja war and had to see all these people like think about like do I really attack but but those then people were dead and we know not only were they dead they were basically immortal because you couldn't kill them unless you sealed them but this is like on a completely different level because mm -hmm. they are these are people who are alive their hearts are beating and they can die and Ichigo has to make a choice here of how does he fight Tsukishima without injuring his friends dude and 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 my thinking is because we saw that little clip of Ishin and Urahara, which they're out to find Ichigo, which obviously it wouldn't surprise me because Urahara is pretty fucking big brain. It wouldn't surprise me that if Urahara would probably know about Fulbring somehow, and they probably plan for something like this to happen. But it definitely looked like so Ishin was carrying that sword, spiritual pressure in the shape of a sword, and maybe they can bring that to Ichigo and it could like use well I don't know I don't know but it definitely seems like that that is something to help Ichigo but we still don't know what Tsukishima's motive exactly is like we still don't know 100% why he had killed those his earlier comrades those other full bringers and killed that one soul reaper and dipped for now it definitely seems like he's going to use all of the people around Ichigo as pawns and probably killed them off like he could probably use them as like a host well they they are essentially hostages he could he could threaten ichigo like oh if you step one one step closer i'll fucking kill inoue or something like Tsukishima definitely has the advantage right now and we don't know his fighting ability we know that man is fast as shit but ichigo was kind of kicking his ass but the fact that he has all of those people that ichigo cares about he has the advantage right now Anyway, guys, this is going to wrap up today's Bleach reaction. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Become a part of the Rice Ball gang today. But anyway, I'll see you guys later. Peace.